Hey, how you doing? Austin here. In this video, we're going to be talking about Cardano ADA. This is absolutely one of my favorite cryptos out there. It's got a ton of utility around it. Um, we've got some new developments with Mark Cuban interfacing with the creator of Cardano. We're going to go look at that. We're going to look at the price point. I just kind of look at overall market scenario, what's going on around it. This is absolutely um, one of the best uh, cryptos out there, in my opinion. It's a good long-term hold, and um, it's just a really, really nice crypto. Not a lot of volatility and very kind of safe and stable and again just one of my favorites this video is for entertainment purposes only i am not a financial advisor i'm not a stockbroker so invest at your own risk and spread your risk around to different cryptos and outside of crypto as well again not financial advice um public service announcement comments below if there's anybody that looks and that looks like me trying to get you to go to whatsapp that's not me if anybody looks like me trying to get trying recommending a broker that's not me don't interface with them i would never ask you to do any of that kind of stuff keeping you safe is my goal trying to help you navigate the crypto waters is what i care about all right let's do it let's go take a look at what the latest and greatest is with cardano before we do that poll do you think that Cardano is going to hit $3 anytime in the near future? Right now, we're trading at approximately $2.08. What are your thoughts on hitting $3? Drop in the comments below, positive or negative. Let me hear from you. I read all the comments. I do look at them and would love to hear from you. So with that said, let's go see what's up with Cardano. So as you can see, we are currently trading at $2.07. We're down about one97 uh, percent overall just basically down about four pennies looking at this chart we look at what the red line 20 day moving average purple line 50 day moving average very very nice trend line down today but we've got our highs of two dollars and thirty cents uh, and we're just actually one day off of that high and again currently trading at two dollars and seven cents i really do like the trend line here uh, we've got a nice established trend moving up uh, we should continue to see it moving up the overall kind of crypto market looks like. Let's go take a look at that real quickly. So you've got kind of overall market conditions here. Number one, Cardano has absolutely moved into the fourth place, this, this um, displacing Dogecoin. You guys know I'm a fan of Dogecoin for the various reasons. If you've watched any of my Doge videos, if you haven't, go check them out. Uh, but you can see that Cardano is at a 66 billion uh, Doge is at a 63 billion, and you can see right here that Cardano is moving into or moving after Binance um, overall. But really, what I want to focus you on is look at the 24 hour uh, column. Okay, so what you've got here is you've got really a flat or slash, flat slash, flat slash down market, right? Uh, we've got XRP making a breakout. That's nice. I'm a fan of XRP as well. Uh, but overall, kind of the market is a little flat. Even when it's down, you can see they're not down tremendous amount. Um, you know, we're down one, two, three, four percent across almost all of the top 20, 25, 30 uh, cryptos out there. So the overall market is a really a sideways kind of slash flat market right now. Again, I like this uh, over on digital coin price. I like this snapshot. So, uh, you know, use this for your own. This gives you kind of a feel for what is going on in the overall top 100 crypto currencies and it's on digitalcoin.com. Okay, so that's kind of, oh, and look, there you go. See, I started doing a video and now we've, we've uh, traced into positive territory. That's all I have to do. I do a video. I'm a market mover. You know, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. All right. All right. So let's take a look real quickly here at on coin market cap, looking at Cardano, looking at just kind of now, obviously that, that change has not been reflected here. The 24 hour, there we go. Just, uh, just, just barely down a little bit, but here's what I wanted to point out overview, excuse me, real quickly, kind of look at a seven day overview scenario, uh, market cap, excuse me, volume, I apologize, 7.46, we're raising in volume a little bit, but overall, look look at the gray, the gray right here, uh, let me move it up here for you, gray, the volume is pretty consistent and, you know, moving up, but, you know, we've really got a little bit of volatility in the last day or so, um, yeah, so like around 15, 16, you can see we got a little bit of volatility where we're hitting 244, Actually, I apologize earlier. I misspoke on the Yahoo chart. Uh, our, our, our high is right around in here in the 240, 245 range on May 16th at approximately 2.29 a.m. Uh, and then we've got you know dips all the way down to 202. So we've definitely got some movement as far as kind of high to low, but it would seem that the high dollar 90 and kind of that 209, 206, I'm kind of looking at really, these are really, looks like our support lines. And if you look overall, 
you know, 164 is our 20 day moving average. Let me refresh this to make sure there's something not weird going on. I apologize. We weren't up, so apologize. I hadn't refreshed that screen. Sorry about that, guys. Um, yeah, but $1.64 is our 20 day moving average. Purple line is our 50 day. Again, not anywhere near close to that, okay? And if you look kind of on this chart, this gives you a much better feel that we've really got that sideways pattern. Again, I'm looking at Cardano as more of a long term hold. <clears throat> excuse me, kind of a mid-year, end-year, legitimately got a shot at three plus uh, in the very near future. Again, we know it's ranked number four. Uh, overall, kind of 24 high, 24 lows. We got a $1.93 to 233 uh, scenario there and market cap down just a little bit. All right, so we've already looked at that. If you don't know what Cardano is, if you don't really know what it, uh, what it was created to do, um, it was really created for a couple of main reasons. It is uh, right here. Main applications are identity management and traceability, okay? Um, so can be used to track and audit a product's manufacturing process from provenance to finished goods and potentially eliminate the market for counterfeit goods. Some examples of it is uh, they've got really three products. It is Atala Prism, Atala Scan, Atala Trace. First products marketed as an identity management tool to provide access to services. For example, it can be used to verify credentials, to open a bank account for eligibility to government aid. The other two products are used to trace a product's journey through the supply chain. Again, so Cardano was built with a very specific purpose in mind. And um, you know that's a really good definition if you want. It's over on Investopedia. If you wanna check that out, go to Investopedia and just look up Cardano and you can uh, look up this, uh, this definition about what it is and get some more information around that. Okay, so let's take a look real quickly. Make a look how I'm doing on time. Good, okay, excellent. You guys know I keep my videos around 10 minutes, so that's me checking my time. So Mark Cuban, Roots for Cardano. I love Mark Cuban because if you've watched any of my Dogecoin, Mark Cuban has been an absolute big, huge proponent for Doge. Um, Cardano has an insane amount of development uh, around it, development community, rally around it. Um, very, very engaged development community, um, owner community, things like that. Cardano doesn't really have, um, as of yet, I think it doesn't have the the sex appeal that a Dogecoin does. In fact, I would say that it probably doesn't want that, right? It wants that, it's just, it's it's not, it's different. And I, so again, I like Cardano for a different reason. I like it for the the the, the utility that was, utilities that it was created for, the, the, you know, the reason it was created, um, you know, business related, et cetera. And so I thought that this was cool. Mark Cuban roots for Cardano, Cardano engages with Hoskinson on Twitter. Okay. So he has voiced interest in Cardano in a busy spell on social media. So, so he has engaged in with uh, Cardano ADA CEO, Charles Hoskinson, who invented uh, Cardano um, that began with Cuban questioning what ADA can actually be used for. Okay, you hear one of my dogs? That's our, there they are, there's my Shelties. Uh, it's a question that Cuban says he asks of all cryptocurrencies as he clarified Hoskinson re responded and back and forth ensued and with the ADA CEO giving a brief but detailed pitch in one tweet when Hoskins can re reveal that they had rebuilt their entire smart contract model among other things Cuban announced in reply to Hoskinson that he was quote rooting for you the more valid options for the for the better for all of us but as I've been tweeting for the foreseeable future it all comes down to the utility and marketing when you have some apps you think I could benefit from I'm happy to try them out that coming from Cub Cuban Hoskinson followed this declaration up with a 12 minute video, which he directly addressed to Cuban. In this video, he dished further detail about ADA as well as exposing some of the failings of Ethereum. The ADA creator was one of the eight original founders of Ethereum. However, he parted ways with blockchain company in 2014 after a dispute with Vitalik. Around the same time, Cuban responded to a follower who suggested ADA could be used for merchandise purchases at the business NBA team, the Dallas Mavericks. Alongside Doge, which I've talked about this at length, Mavericks accepts for purchases in his response, Cuban stated he would, quote, happy to sell for ADA, providing the payment processor BitPay will accept it. So current client for, for current climate for Cardano, Cuban's interest comes at a positive time for ADA. May 21 has been a largely successful month so far. Okay, they, they're now moving to the fourth largest crypto. We know that uh, amid this high point, a poll showed that crypto enthusiasts believe Cardano will become the third coin to surpass a $200 billion market cap. It beat both Binance and Doge in this poll with almost 10,000 votes in favor. Wow, that's pretty cool. Doge as a valid payment mechanism. Prior to his ADA conversation, Cuban has been busy. We know that he's been behind Doge, okay? 
Doe do has to terminate, quote, deterministic inflation, meaning the amount of inflation is defined. Okay, he went on to say the supply and demand may lead Doge to, to not survive in the long term. I didn't know that he said that. Interesting. Okay, uh, he the only Doge he owns personally is the quantity bought with the sun, plus that you use on merchandise from Mavericks. Okay, so that's what he said about Doge. I may have to mention that in my Doge video later. But my point is, is that Cardano, again, was built for a different reason. Okay, so let's wrap up with this. I think that Cardano is um, completely different than anything I've really been covering on my channel. I've covered Cardano, I've covered XRP, um, and the videos do well, but you guys want the, the, Doge, the Doge content, the, um, the, the Shiba Inu content, I'm definitely gonna continue to bring you that content. Cardano is different in the in the in the stake that it was a you know a crypto that was built for those specific reasons we went over has specific utility specific uses has an insane amount of developer community and development around it um, and it is going to be one of the cryptos that is going to be here uh, because of its roots related to its utility its business use etc okay I firmly believe this is one of those that's going to be around for a long time will continue to rise I think we're just seeing the beginning of the rise you know in the remainder of this year and to and and you know towards the end of the year and into next year so this is one of those that is a fantastic one. In fact, it's gone up to a dollar, two dollars and nine cents now. So we're rising a little bit, I think, from when I started the video. I'm gonna end the video there. Hope you enjoyed it. Again, this was just to bring you kind of a Cardano update and just kind of tell you what the latest and greatest is going on with it. Hope you've enjoyed it. I'll see you down the road. Again, make good choices um, with your crypto. Don't put all of it on one particular one particular crypto. Spread it around and spread outside of crypto to spread your risk. Just very straightforward advice, not investment advice. That's my disclaimer. See you down the road.